Welcome back, everybody, to Let's Play Samurai Warriors. I am your host, Alexander Frost, and this is episode 46. Now, last time, playing as Magoichi, I screwed up my shot at Kyoto. So this time, I'm actually going to get it right, and if I've done my research correctly, I don't need to go back and play the Yamasaki Crossfire, the Battle of Echizen, and then the Skirmish at Kyoto and get the shot all three times. I think I just need to get the shot at Nobunaga this time, and that'll move me on to Azuchi Infiltration. And if it doesn't, you know what? I'll just manually go to Azuchi. So, let's be off. Not to mention... Not to mention... There was something I wasn't supposed to mention. <laughs> not to mention, I actually figured out the right way to go, and what it is I was supposed to do. Let's see. Yes, I yes I do have that equipped. What do I have that equipped? Because the Tenegashima is not very powerful, and I'm not finding better weapons, so I'll just stick with that. All right, I'm pretty good with what I've got. And I have my battle brothers with me. Let's do this. land has fallen to Nobunaga. Resistance is no longer an option. Regrettably, it seems we may have to surrender to Nobunaga. You must be joking. I didn't come all this way to give up now. <laughs> Me? I'm going after Nobunaga. End of story. Gun starting to feel heavy. First, we'll have to seal the enemy entrance. All right, so run these people no over. Point in resisting now. Should we not accept this as destiny? Come on, enough of the worthless, useless talk. It's starting to sound like Nobunaga. There are no worthless lives, and there are no useless endeavors. Oh, I thank you. No hard feelings. And as uh, okay, for all. your skills. Crawl to slay. Oh, you know what? I'm actually gonna go south. I'll go south. Run into Mitsuhide. I'll take care of this one first, and then I'll take care of the one in the east. I don't get what the point of him firing his gun like that is. If he doesn't hit the one enemy and juggle them, it only knocks him over. So it just seems like a waste to me. <clears throat> mm, have to excuse me, just got home from school, so I'm a little, little tired this morning. Well, at least it's still more than here. No, no, I can hit him twice. Alright, stronghold sealed. There's the fire attack. Again with the fire. Is that all they know? We pass by no. He intends to set the capital aflame. That's why I'm going to stop it. For the capital to be reduced to Darn it. I should have put it action. Oh no, there's no. And then there's Katie. Attacking the capital for no good reason. That won't do at all. Magoichi, this one doesn't look like it's for the people. If it's a fight you want, a fight's what you'll get. And then there's Oichi. Sadly, I'm not going to have time to take them all out, because I'm going to try to finish this mission quickly. Now, there, here comes the spy leader. Beat him up. And at this point, they decide that they're going to, yeah, surrender. Oops, sorry. Oh. 
So going back the way we came, we'll have just enough time to get into position to fight. Oh. This is our thing. You must accept it as well. How could you? Why? Why are you giving up now? Why can't you have the courage to carve out your own path? Because they're spineless pussies. Now, we must meet with Nobunaga and inform him that we will surrender. Plus, they've seen what Nobunaga's capable of. They would rather be by his side as his prisoners than, you know, in front of him as his enemies. Not that he really treated his prisoners any better. Hmm. I'm thinking Nobunaga's getting the better end of this deal no matter how this turns out. Now, can't go that way because there's a barricade in the way. Lord Magoichi, get a hold of yourself. The Psycho mercenaries will always be by your side. I'd forgotten. I'm not fighting for those guys' sakes. I'm fighting for myself, and for those who believe in me. And for the ladies, of course. Nobunaga's head is my only target. I have to do it before he meets with Kenya. Just enough time to kill that guy and get in position. Get pretty close without being seen. That rooftop is about the only place. No hard feelings. The trick here is you have to make sure you're actually near the edge of the roof, because if you're not, for some reason, you won't be able to take the shot, so... Oh, hell, I'm gonna keep shooting. Nobunaga, I still have unfinished business with you. Magoichi, did you not see what happened with Kenyo? No Kenyo, no Honganji. This is my war now. Very well. We all must follow our own path. Hey, by the way, Nobutada. No hard feelings. I bow to your skills. I could have sworn that was two. Alright, these guys are guys. No hard feelings. That was lucky. I just hit circle out of reflex and it worked. <laughs> what folly. The war may be over for Honganji, but my war is just beginning. Hmm. Losing doesn't really suit a guy like me. So, the first time you want to try and get the good ending, you have to take the shots at the first two missions, at uh, Yamasaki and the Battle of Echizen, and then take the shot here. Only then will you get the good ending. But, since I had just turned on the machine, I haven't played any other mission. This skirmish at Kyoto was the first mission I played. Getting that shot off at Nobunaga means that... The second time around, you only need to play this mission to immediately advance to the final one. Interesting. Sort of a shortcut, I suppose. The game just assumes you got the shots. No, no. That's crappy. Oh, wow, you guys are level 15! You guys are doing good. Yeah, I'm 32 KOs. That's okay. Hmm. Ah, that's what I was looking for, I claim. Uh, yeah, that's a good one. You know what, let's just move on. No point in saving, we know what we're doing.
finally, a Zuchi infiltration. Sadly, I cannot take my battle brothers with me. lantern so I can find my way around. I'll keep that gun. I won't go to that because you've seen that. Alright, let's do it. So that's it. People always seem to confuse what they want to do with what they have to do. <laughs> Me, I just do what I want to do. The Battle of Hongganji is over. Now it's time for my war. It's the enemy! Intruder! Get them! Get them! And my war alone. Now for the grand finale. <laughs> Nobunaga, this is the day you die. Oh, you're pretty quick, Makuchi. Oop, not quick enough. Alright, done this before. Ow. Your friends kept you down. It must be Nobunaga. I'll just give him my usual grief. I see you still have not learned your lesson. Nice to see you too. Meet me at the tower. I deal with you. So yeah, even if you hadn't sniped him, he would have run away into there, and there's no way you could have beaten him. I mean, maybe, maybe if you were fast enough, you could have shot him, knocked him down, and rushed over there, and maybe beat on him before he escaped. But I'm pretty sure the programmers planned for that eventuality and would have been like, Oh, it's just a decoy, go to the tower. <laughs> Probably. And this is the dumbest trap ever. Or quite possibly an ingenious trap, because it works in conjunction with that saw blade. Oh, I see how it works now. You see the floor trap, you see it's obvious, you think, oh, well, <laughs> obvious trap, it's obvious. And then you start hugging the wall, and then saw blade! Kind of crap. I'm gonna shoot you in the gut after I stab you. Bang! Didn't feel good, did it? Oh, you want to do it again? Shall we go for three? Didn't think so. Now then. You know what? I want what's in this box, but there's nothing in the box, so... yeah. No idea how many floors this is. No, oh, Hanzo. What the hell are you doing here? Hey there, Hanzo. It wouldn't be wise of you to mess with me today. <laughs> <laughs> Silly little ninja. I told you, you 
don't want to mess with me today. You can read your movements like a book. No hard feelings. Shadows never die forever. Yeah. Right. More ninjas. Because always more ninjas. Seriously, the exit's right here? Well, of course, you're not supposed to have the map, so you just kind of wander around blindly for a while. I'm willing to bet it's going to be the next level where I'm going to start running into people guarding that gate. I hope so. I'm going to run into Keiji, I know. Oichi, possibly. Maybe even no. Oh look, there's Oichi. You're here to shoot my brother, aren't you? Yep. I have a policy of never hurting women. So if you can kindly let me by, I guess not. Which means run away! Run away from the grave! Oh, Jesus. Okay. Advancing with the blades? Smart. Advancing against the blades or horizontal to the blades? Really fucking stupid. Okay, I... How do I get out? I almost did it again. I would like to leave this room. I would like to no longer be here, but I am clearly not going the right way. Oh, um... Am I just lost as hell? Yes, I am. See, some of the traps are intelligently placed. Some just make you go, what were they thinking? Alright, who is this over here? I just want to know who this is. I'm not going to fight him, I just want to know who it is. And I'm not in a position to find that out quickly, so mystery person, you get to live another day. Oh, goody. Come on, get up, dude. Yes, I've seen this before. Man, she is dogging me. <laughs> well, it's probably because there are no obstacles in the way, and we started in the same spot. Now, I don't know if harming Oichi counts as actually attacking her or what, but I could have possibly tried to knock her off those stairs. Hey! Don't run away, you coward! You're not the first woman to say that to me. Oh, yes, yeah, it's the little girl with the lightning toy! Could you let me pass? Zap! Guess not. Alright, now what? Oh. Hi. Let's make this one to remember. Well, I knew I was going to run into you, so. Hey, what's this? I thought you weren't going to fight the Honganji. <laughs> yeah, that's right. But this fight is between you and me. This is the last one. Let's get wild. <laughs> Oh, I bet you thought that was really fucking funny, kicking him back like that. Crap, 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 ow, ow, ow. This was fun! Catch you later! Oh good, I didn't kill him. I like KG, he's alright. He's just a seeker of good battles, and I just went the wrong way. Now that's what I'm talking about. 
I'll see you again soon. Not if I see you first. Nope, this way. Ooh, box of treasure. Ah, box with worthless item. Worthless item. Oh, it's just no butata. Well, that's a stupid move. There we go. Straw blade. You know, I'm expecting fire, or maybe more ninjas. Nope. Nothing of the sort. Alright then. This should be the last level before I make it to the top of the tower, so I'm probably going to run into Ron Maru. I would run away if I were you. Plan on it. I will determine your worth as a man. You should feel honored. Hey now, I'd be stupid to refuse an offer like that. Unfortunately, I just don't have the time. I have a score to settle with Nobunaga. And once again, we show our chivalrous, or should I say, yeah, chival chivalrous side and decide to run, although, technically speaking, he's only chivalrous because he wants to get with the ladies, and I can't fault him for that. I could try. Alright, um, this way? This way. Japanese house design. It's fucking amazing. Alright, she's not dogging me quite as fast as Oichi was, but... Well, Oichi had freedom of movement with her legs, whereas No's legs are kind of restricted by her clothing. Princess, let's meet somewhere more romantic next time. Well, at least she didn't call me a coward. Nobunaga, where are you? <laughs> Do you seek death? I'm actually glad that I met you. I suppose there is some value in your body. I just wanted to tell you that you've been a good enemy. My only enemy. Kind of hurt. I'm trying to get rid of these buddies here because they really need to not be in this fight. Writer captains. Okay, that takes care of them. Now it's just you and me, and oh, looky, just what I needed. Should have used your sword. Okay. That. That right there is why I hate ice. Try to knock an enemy into an air with a perfect combo, and what happens? You freeze them on the ground, and you... Oh. I mean, it does have the advantage of making them vulnerable, and they take more damage, so I, I can't argue with that, I guess. Motherfucker. Damn it. Losing doesn't really suit a guy like me. And now you have to climb out of the tower without getting killed by Oichi and No, and all the soldiers you didn't kill. A level 10 marksman, not bad. 
would have been higher, except that he had a lot less battles than everyone else, but still. Oh, we'll go with that. change after you shoot <laughs> nothing nothing will change the turmoil the sorrow it will continue will you shoot can you are you ready to shoulder the burden that <sighs> that's enough out of you nobunaga you were a powerful man but you know Everyone, everyone carries a burden in life. That's just how it is. Your burden was no heavier and no lighter than anyone else's. Obviously, to spare us from gore, they... Well, I don't know if he actually... No, he did kill him. But because there wasn't actually a definitive bang, and there was no muzzle flash, nor was there any blood splatter, blood spatter, I can only reason that, based on the scene, it looked like Magoichi hit Nobunaga in the head with the business end of his gun. Hard enough, probably, to crack the skull and damage the brain inside. And considering the, uh, the design of it, with the, the, uh, the flip-out bayonet, I would imagine that bit of metal there probably added weight and helped. But obviously it was supposed to be he shot him, but you know, sensor purposes and all that good stuff. So that's it. That is it for Magoichi's tale. And tomorrow we move on. I will finish the duel in the desert for Valkyria Chronicles, and more importantly, I'll explain what's going on. As for who I'm going to choose next, well, to be honest, I'm torn between Oichi and another person, since it's my turn to choose this time. I don't think I'm going to choose Oichi. I'm tempted, but I don't think I will. Yeah. Alright, folks. I will see you on the next video.